true. Very true. I should use all of my uh, analogies in terms of Pikachu edge guards. Okay, yeah, oh, yeah. so I, I, it wasn't Hydra. Yeah, did not Shot in the dark. Flip. Yeah, Kimi Mara versus Let's Go. Okay. So I, I am very eager to, to see how this plays out because the last time I saw this this matchup featuring Kimi Mara was when Hipster was still in NorCal. Oh, okay. So that was when um, uh, Let's Go is also NorCal? I don't know where Let's Go is from. Okay. I don't think it's from NorCal. I think it's Washington State. I see. Oh, but kind of similar geographically. So. They're, they're, they, they're, they're distinct scenes. Yeah. Okay. I, I've, I've never known Seattle to show up to a NorCal tournament. Mm -hmm. That's fair, though. Oh, oh just quite. missed space. Yeah, from Kimimaro. Okay. There wow. we go. Love it. When the up smash won't connect, that forward smash will. Yeah, he's. Kimimaro has just a very fine control of. Uh, of his up air hitbox, as we saw right there. And it's so good, especially in this matchup for the combo game. So one thing that I'm curious to, uh, to look for is, does Let's Go reflect Kimimaro's fireballs? And does and what is Kimimaro going to do about it if he does? Mm. Oh, good tech chase. Okay, yeah, this is a, not a situation Let's Go wants to be Hell. in. Oh. Because Kimimaro has those. Yeah, he really does. Four smash? Uh, I, 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 I'm not sure if that was a flub. Forward, up angled forward tilt is a sort of weird thing to see. Yeah, it is. But a uh, great dash attack to push him off stage, and another and a uh, great use of fireball to finish the edge guard. Yeah. Oh! And does like that, he's traded two stocks for 100%, and he might be working on a third. That'll do it! Ow. Three stocks for 103%. That third is zero to death. That was a really great uh, start of that. Wow, and absolutely no oh punish God. on the whiffed up smash. Let's go, can't afford not to punish that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's one of the few areas that it's just really okay to go in. Oh, okay. I like that. Good call. There we go. Good uh, read on that. Multi ball. I'm impressed. Uh, okay. It's something that happens in the matchup a lot. Yeah. And the extend gets him back to stage. Yep. But let's go. Isn't able to keep the edge guard going. Exceeds. So this is okay. Hey. Just run up and do it. <laughs> just but poke so, around in neutral. Yeah. So Kimimaro was employing a technique that the melee players call stage humping. <laughs> It doesn't I've never heard it called that, but I trust you. Yeah, it, 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 it it's is just crouch not crouching in the stage, right? Yeah, so yeah. It, it's not very useful in very many circumstances. Whoa. Why? Okay, there we go. Let's go. Is let's go starting this. to show up. Yeah, let's really. Go. Let's go, let's go. Okay. Yeah, but he got hit, which is bad. <laughs> I'd say so. It looked like Kimimaro lost his wallet, though. I'm not entirely sure what he was doing. Oh. I think maybe he was anticipating a tech uh, tech in. Great mix up with the dash dance. Keeps Kimimaro locked in shield. And that's oh. another whipped up smash. He's playing so patient. He's not at all going in it. Wow, Kimimaro's rhythm. It's not going to kill. Not quite. I think Kimimaro might have been aiming for the reverse ledge die with that up B. Yeah. Oh, whoa. <laughs> this is some tight uh, footsies right there. These up bears and the bears are just barely whiffing on each other. Yeah. He, Kimimaro has to throw those out to make Let's Go respect him, so that yeah. Let's Go won't, won't, won't just run in and do an, another up smash like that. It's very... Oh, uh, and the fireball. Oh, and Confirm off the fireball. That should do it. Really and nice. And Kimimaro takes game one with two stocks remaining. You want to know why I thought it was Hydra? Because yesterday, Hydra was wearing blue and Kimimaro was wearing red, so I was hoping they color-coded. It's, it's just like you said, they gave us the mix-up. They, they, they totally gave us the mix-up. Man, there's a reason these guys are in D1. Yeah, and, and you, you did see Hydra step up to say a few words of encouragement to Kimimaro. Yeah. Making making full use of the allowance for mid-set coaching. I think it's nice as long as it's not, um, like, disruptive. Or use, like, where someone, you know, doesn't have uh, access to a coach. But regardless, we're back in this game, too. Wow, Kimimaro is so strong. Yeah. Both these players really keeping the pressure up, and Kimimaro just coming out slightly on top. Yeah, with a good edge in the punish and the edge guard. Yeah, I mean Fox is definitely easier to edge guard. Yeah, Mario. No, like, no Ma double jump. Mario is one of those characters that can basically just do whatever he wants to Fox once Fox is off stage. Yeah. But, like the Mario Brothers, Kirby, Pikachu, all have such so many off stage options that they don't really have to think too hard about it once Fox goes. Uh, once they push Fox off stage, they can just yeah, and Fox doesn't have too many options. Leisure. Period as well. I mean, that's why they they get to pick yeah. up the ledger. Yeah, it go, it cuts both ways. All right, so Kimimaro is starting to bring out the fireballs, and I always really enjoy watching his fireball game. Yeah, fireball such a cool projectile. Oh no! Oh, he's not dead. 
That's that is that is Mario's power. He it's can survive so good. that. And I mean, not many characters can, but Mario is one of them. Good awareness to not go for a down B, just make it to ledge. Know that your recovery is faster than the foxes. Yeah, he, he was going way low, and Let's Go didn't fall for any gimmicks. That was good. Well, yeah, I mean, at this point, you're down a stock. You really can't afford to make any wrong reads. And, or and, be and before down. that, he was down two stocks. Yeah. But he, you know, ended up cleaning it up by not overextending, by um, not going for hard reads, but being able to react more and, when in doubt, play safe. I mean, even when you're not in doubt, it's typically a good idea. So you see yeah. right there, he, he jumped... The, uh, the reflected fireball, did another fireball and confirmed off of that. Amazing. That's the adaptation that we really expect in D1. Oh, DI? More DI, and he gets the reverse, but oh. Let's Go is able to go up and get it. Yeah, yeah Washington backing up their boy behind us. Yeah? Okay. Yeah, but Kimiyamaro is just right nice. there with the Angel Invincibility. Yeah, it's always very tough to um, not get caught by that, but... Just gotta respect that invincibility. Yeah, he managed to do it that time by letting Let's Go read a jump and not giving it to him. And it's like, it's uh, decisions like that that will, you know, just change the game. It'll change the results. And it's really what sets uh, Kimamaro apart, I think. Wow. I. It's been a long time since I've been in NorCal, so I gotta talk about it again. I love Kimamaro's hot cold game. Yeah. Such a good mix-up. Just changing up the rhythm. Oh, let's see this. Oh. Uh-huh. Some pressure. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Catching him with that down tilt. Oh, he was... He needed that laser. He was counting on that laser. Yeah, that was just the perfect setup. Oh. Anti-air up tilt. That was like a last second up air. Instantly cancelled into an up tilt. Wow. Not quite... Yeah, no, good drift from Let's Go, falling farther on the platform than Kimamaru expected. Yeah. Let's Go grabbing Kimamaru out of the depths. Kimamaru has had that reverse ledge DI very consistently so far this set. I don't the know. the neutraler push him off. For Let's Go, I don't know if it's better for him to That'll go for reverse bear. Okay, but that's it. When the up bear is not going to kill, maybe it's better to keep pushing Mario off. And, uh, uh, you know, just change based on that. A reverse uh, back air. Yeah, it is true. Fox 